What's good folks, Reds here. Tonight's soap review is going to feature a pre-release soap, Ariana and Evans Summer Fig. Uh, this is due to release on the Shaving Shop Club website on June 2nd for members of the club. It'll be available for a uh, one week exclusivity period before being uh, available to everyone uh, through the website on June 9th. So strongly urge you to uh, pay attention to this one if you're into fig scents. And um, it's been nice to see the Ariana and Evans line grow as the retail arm of the club. Uh, they're now available in West Coast Shaving. Um, Q Brothers, which also sells through their online reseller, uh, Small Flower. Um, Top of the Chain in Canada and uh, TVB Shaving over in Europe. All links for those uh, third-party sellers will be below if you're interested in checking out their uh, current Ariana and Evan offerings. All right, so Summer Fig is a uh, kind of a classic scent. I was surprised off the puck. Um, it's a classic scent to me with a fig twist, and and when I say classic scent, it it quite the the base of the scent and um, quite a few of the notes remind me of um, Gillette Sunup, the uh, oak moss and musk towards the ass end of the scent and uh, the sandalwood. They all come together and uh, really remind me of that Gillette Sunup uh, scent. But where it diverges for me is the um, the sweetness of the fig uh, kind of plays a forward role rather than the citrusiness <clears throat> that you get from Sunup. So I'm really, um, I quite like this scent. It's very unique. It wasn't exactly what I was envisioning based on the description uh, Summer Fig, but the execution is uh, is really cool. So if you're a fan of Gillette Sunup, or um, I know Barrister and Man has released Barrister's Reserve Classic, which is a nod to that scent in a uh, basically a recreation of that scent since it's been discontinued for quite a few years now. Um, I think you really, really enjoy this one. Uh, notes are listed as bergamot, tangerine, fig, jasmine, sandalwood, oak moss, and musk. Uh, I gave you what it's doing to my nose. Perhaps you'll, you'll get it in a different variation, but uh, to me this is uh, very reminiscent of Gillette Sunup with a fig twist, and I can't say enough uh, about the cool factor of this scent right now. Uh, scent strength is strong, which you've come to expect from uh, the Ariana and Evans line of soaps, uh, as well as all the ones on Peter's site. And um, for comparable scents, the only one I'll offer is the aforementioned uh, Barrister's Reserve Classic. All right, for those of you who uh, have yet to try the Ariana Evans uh, tell on goat milk formula when you uh, get around to it, you're in for a real treat. This is one of my top five soap bases has been since we uh, were fortunate enough to test it out and help uh, get it where Peter wanted it to be. Uh, it's a mid-firm soap. Still loads very easily into uh, any brush type you uh, may be using. Uh, this is a thirsty soap. It really rewards you for patience while lathering and proper hydration. When properly dialed in, it's about as dense as Cool Whip, but it has a, a nice sheen like Elmer's glue. Um, slickness is elite level. That would be both the primary slickness as well as the residual slickness left behind after the uh, blade has passed over the lather. And uh, as good as the slickness and density are on this, the real star for me is the uh, post shave. 
Uh, goat milk is great at post shave and uh, this is a testament to that because you could easily slap some extra lather on your face, let it sit there, rinse, rinse it off and walk away and you will not need an aftershave product to uh, help this soap base at all. Your skin will be left soft and supple. The resulting shave score from all those uh, accolades is a 95 and that puts it in line with soaps for me such as uh, Holy Cow Donkey Milk as well as the Declaration Grooming Bison Tallow Base. Alright folks we're back excellent face and dome shave with the uh, Ariana and Evans Summer Fig. Looking forward to this being available to the uh, club members June 2nd as well as uh, everyone else on uh, June 9th. I think you're all going to be quite impressed with this uh, fig twist on a pretty classic and uh, well-known scent. So hope you all enjoy it and uh, as such I'll be pairing the um, soap with this for my uh, aftershave as you saw in the uh, video splits below or previously I should say gonna take a short break from shaving videos perhaps for the rest of the week and into next week because I'll be heading out on uh, Friday to the 2018 Maggard uh, Razors meetup out in uh, Adrian Michigan hope to see some of you there if you do see me stop by say hello I like to interact with everyone out there and I look forward to seeing many of you as always thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it Comment below if you have anything to say, and if you're not already a subscriber, please become one. See ya.